Hola YouTube, welcome to my channel, She Beats Beauty, and today we're going to be doing a video about a blind buy. These are blind buy videos that I'm supposed to be doing. They're supposed to be on Tuesdays, but since I have a couple and I've been like hoarding these for a couple months, I really want to get these out the way because um, I really want to smell them because they're just sitting in my, in my on my dresser. And I haven't even smelled them. So, um, but this one is one that I have smelled. This is pink sugar. Maybe this is pink sugar. It looks like this by Aqua Aqualina. Aqualina. Um, I got the one ounce version of it, and I got it from I got it from Kohl's. Got it from Kohl's. Looks like this. See, I've used a good bit of it. Um, it smells really good. So before I go any further, what I think about it, I'm going to tell you about what uh, Fragrantica, Fragrantica thinks of um, what Fragrantica has on this bottle. Okay, so I'm gonna just read it off of the website. The main accords are, um, it's sweet, it's caramel, it has vanilla, um, it's fruity, it's powdery, um, soft and spicy. All right, this is what you do whenever you do not want to do your hair. And it pulls everything together. All right, so it says... It, Aqualina is a cosmet, Italian cosmetic brand. Um, so it's a fruity candy floss type of smell. Um, quite frankly, quite frankly, it smells like cotton candy. It's really, 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 really sweet. So it's not like some type of, um, it's not a niche. It's not, it's like, something you would get at like Walmart. I mean, actually, I think you can get it at Walmart now, but it smells really good. So I try to, if I can have to tell somebody what it smells like, it smells like, you know, back in the day when you have a, like whenever you have a card and you get like a credit card, a plastic credit card, and you go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, and you get that hot plasticky smell. That's to me, how um, this cotton candy, I mean, this um, pink sugar smells. It smells like that plasticky smell, and then also smells like um, pure sugar with cotton candy. And then I, today, I sprayed it on myself earlier today. And whenever um, I sprayed it, I was just like, I smell like some type of fruit in it. And I didn't think I smelled fruit, but then whenever I look on the, um, um, even though it says fruity, you get that drowning of a sugar. You get the drowning of the caramel, just sweet, sweet gourmand, uh, a gourmand smell. And but whenever it dried down, I I was just like, I catch something fruity in here. And come to find out, some of the main accords in here, the main notes, it's got um, fruit in it. It's got the raspberry, the lime. It's even got. Um, it's got strawberries. It's got a. It's heavy on the berries, so I will say that it has it. Maybe you can smell it in the dry down, but whenever you first spray it, it just blasts you with some vanilla and caramel candy, sweet cotton candy smell. This is something that I will wear around the house. This is something that um, once Planet Fitness opens, opens back up, I will be wearing this at Planet Fitness. Um, I think this is uh, a compliment getter. I think um, men will like it. I think it attracts men because men like, you know, something. They like the sweet, all you can eat type of smells. Um, what else? Oh, and I wear it to bed. Like if I need to feel like cozy and just it envelops you, it just makes you want to just like, it's like a warm hug. It really is. Um, so I think that's about it. You can really get this anywhere. Um, you can get it off of um, Fragrance Net, I think. You can get it off of, you can get it at Kohl's, online Kohl's. You can get just about anything at Walmart. You can get it at Walmart. Um, 
where else? I mean, excuse me. All you have to do is just look it up. You can find it. I really like this a lot. So I think what I'm going to do is buy another one. Um, I probably will buy a bigger version of it. But like I said, I'm not sure if I said it in my other videos. But whenever I get these blind buys, unless it's something like I know for a fact I'm going to like, I'm getting a one ounce. I like this, so I'm going to get another, um, a bigger, um, a bigger bottle. But um, one of the fragrances that I really want, one thing that I really want to do is get into niche, buying niche um, fragrances. Um, I think I will just automatically buy a full bottle of Delina. There's one, um, there's Rouge Malachite. I've heard of that. That's one that I really want to get. I'm probably just going to get the full bottle. Um, where's another one? Oh, and Baccarat Rouge. Um, I've already smelled that one. I've got like a little sample and to me, it's, it's got, now I got a little sample. It's very small. And so I got a very small sample. So I'm thinking, you know, it smells ordinary to me, but maybe since I've got it in a little bottle that, you know, maybe I need to just go full on. I really liked it. So I need to go full on and just, um, get the the bigger bottle i'm trying to think of something else um everybody likes mfk black right rouge so you know i kind of want something to get because where i live people aren't just buying that kind of stuff i also want to get santel 33 and a couple of others but um coming up with my sorry about the screen shaking Coming up with um, the rest of my videos, I'm going to do a video with um, the other three fragrances that I have. I've not smelled them. I've had them for months, and I'm just kind of itching for Tuesday to come because that's called Blind by Tuesday. Okay? Blind by Tuesday. And um, I'm itching to smell them. I don't know if I'm going to... It's going to be three, one of the three. So I have Lush, well, a Lush product, by, and it's called Lust. I got it because people said, you know, it smells like, because, you know, it's just, just kind of a sexy smell and it's heavy on the jasmine. So they, they say it's got this gritty smell to it. So I can't wait to smell that. And I got the little one ounce bottle. Then I've got um, three, the three, two, three point four ounces of the Lampita, Lolita Lampica. Um, I got that because um, I've been hearing a lot about it and because all I do is watch videos and stay on fragrance net and all kinds of stuff so um, I got that one and one of the reasons why I was just like I gotta get that is because it has licorice in it and men like licorice that is one of the um that is one of the scents and smell that men are attracted to go figure and, and it's like it gives you, it gives them like a, they get aroused when they smell that. It's that, um, the mixture of um, licorice and lavender. I don't know if Lampica has, Lolita Lampica has um, lavender in it, but I know it has licorice in it and I can't wait to smell it because I'm not really necessarily a fan of um, licorice, but I trust all the, um, trust all the videos that I've seen that, that say it smells good. So that's gonna be a gem for me. I know when I like it, I think I'm gonna like all the fragrances that I buy because I'm just, I love the way things smell. I love the smell. I love the artistry of fragrances. Um, the other one, the last one is the Britney Spears Midnight Fantasy. Now I was gonna get just the fantasy but I heard someone saying that the Midnight Fantasy was really, really good. So I was just like, nah, you know, I can get the Fantasy whenever. Let me just go and get the Midnight Fantasy. So I got that one, and I don't know anything about it except for... I know. I don't know anything about it. I, I can't remember anything about it other than the packages that is blue. I can't wait to open it up. So I think that's it. All that I have today. Um... So I'm gonna get out of here, please. You know, rate my video. Tell me what I need to do. Um, I'm just starting out. I got this little lamp here. It's really small, and um, I really want to get some use out of it before I go and get a camera. Um, 
So, you know, tell me what I need to do. You know, comment it below. Tell me what I need to do. Like it or dislike it. Look, I'm the type of person that, you know, I think um, uh, negative press, negative attention is good as is good and better than no attention at all. So I like that kind of stuff. And um, if you like me, subscribe. I'm going to start doing a little bit more. So um, I'm glad to be here. Bye.